guess it's the scale that Kevin's talking about, which is planet scale and multi-century scale. What is managing the commons made of? Is this a form of governance that is uh, extremely local and grassrootsy, somewhat global? Um, what are we looking at here to manage the commons at, at planet scale in the Anthropocene? So, you know, there's all sorts of futurists that write about this. My own little futurist vision of that is that our, you know, social networking, our, uh, you know, these things. Mm -hmm. um, I would like to, it's like my idea for, for, for climate change is it's so hard for people to, to believe in cli that climate change is happening is, is I would like to have an app. And the app allows you to take pictures of birds. The birds are easy. Hmm. And I'd, I'd pick the set of species. It gives a GPS coordinates. You know exactly where it is, and you know that its range is expanding. And you create a community that, through this, is aware of you're part of tracking what's going on in your environment. And I think the social net. You know, it's not. I Bill McKibben calls them iPad idiots, and I think he's an idiot for saying that because we have to embrace uh, that culture. That's the. You know, that's where we're going to get. The, the sense of community um, is, is if people feel connected this way and could share data and could share information. I bet you if we got this iPad, I don't know what species I'd pick, but I bet you if I got this set up and you could take pictures of birds and you could find out this is the northernmost this has ever been. And that was broadcast all over the world. You know, and there were other people other places say this is the northernmost I'd ever get. It would, people would suddenly say, wow, things are changing. And it would become real to them and they become you know, part of that. So that's my futurist vision. Thank you. <laughs>